On our booth at the SPS Fair this year, some of the key topics we're showing is our cooperation with Profibus, Profinet International, the new coupler specification that shows how CCLink IE and Profinet can work together. We also are launching CCLink IE Field Basic, which is the new technology from CLPA. We also have a working demo of CCLink IE products from various partners. We have a comprehensive display of various different partner products showing how we have a comprehensive catalogue of CCLink and CCLink IE products already. This morning we did a press conference and the press conference had two main themes. The first one was launching the specification for the CCLink IE to Profinet coupler. We were pleased to be able to actually develop that specification and release it in actually less than one year. We think that was a fairly significant achievement for the two organisations and our partners. The other theme of the press conference today was that we were launching what we call CCLink IE Field Basic. This is a new version of CCLink IE Field which runs on 100 megabit Ethernet. So this means that you can now take any 100 megabit Ethernet device and you can implement CCLink IE Field on it by only doing software development. So this means that the range of devices which are now available to support CCLink IE can grow tremendously because it's now a much simpler process to implement the network on the device only by using software. There's no need to do any hardware development. The main aim of the cooperation with PI is that we want to work together with our colleagues there to offer end users and machine builders the maximum flexibility as they operate globally. Here in Europe, there's a lot of companies who have networks that are based on Profinet, but maybe they need to incorporate machinery from Asia that may be operating using CCLink IE. So the idea of the corporation is to produce the specification for a coupler, which will allow that Profinet network to communicate with a CCLink IE machine that may be from a different part of the world. So now the coupler specification has been completed, the next step is to develop what we call the link device. With the idea of the coupler is this is a higher level device which will allow machinery to be connected together on different networks. The idea of the link device is to take it to a lower level where we will allow devices from the other network to connect to the other network type. We are hoping to develop that specification sometime in the near future. We're happy to have this cooperation with PI. We're hoping that maybe as time goes on, this will act as a kind of role model for how the automation industry can serve its customers, especially end users, better. Customers are more focused on making their products rather than the technologies that they use. We're hoping that this kind of cooperation maybe can act as a trend for the future.